What is up everyone, welcome back to another video and in this one we're going to be talking about how to install and fully activate Multisim version 12. Well, before we start, some of you may already know about Multisim, some of you don't. So simply put, Multisim is like the, as it, the official website describes, is for the advanced industry standard simulation environment kind of stuff used by educators, researchers, and engineers worldwide. But really, as a student, what does multisim means to you? Well, in my university, Damascus University, Faculty of Mechanical Electrical Engineering, uh, we use this for simulating electrical circuits, some kind of logic circuits and logic gates and or exclusive or and that kind of stuff. So it's very important to us. The problem is we don't have any way to give them the money because this application is obviously paid. So I put the, uh, the link in the description of this video to download it for free. It's about 700 megabytes. Um, yes, after you download it, just extract it to any folder you want. And let's go and install this. Just click on setup icon. A very simple setup. Okay just where while the installer and put any name CA uh, the name of your company Hamak just click install this product for evaluation we'll activate it later yeah if you want these uh, uh, plugins you can you can install them next I don't want for important messages no thank you yeah you can read this all day long I accept them without any read. I trust them. Yeah. So while the program installs, I'll pause the video and I will see you after the installation complete. Welcome back. As you can see right now, the installation is complete and the NI Cir Circuit Design Suite 12 has been installed. Just click next. And after you just finished installing this product and by the way I'm installing it right now on Windows 10 uh, the creators update as you can see my build here 15063.138 but I can assume that it will work um, it's gonna work on uh, Windows 10 and 8.1 uh, right now I just wanna restart my computer just click restart later so we can activate it go back and to the NI license activator and run it as administrator so yes just click right click to activate 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 the full edition activate the power pro edition for the LD board activate and just activate see this is a very easy stuff I mean just okay we activate it and right now really there is nothing to do. No, no. There is n nothing left to do. Um, let me see if I can open the app here. Yeah, go to the multi sim. Let's see if it can work without restarting my machine. And uh, this is activated. If it's, it doesn't work and it really needs to be restarted, uh, okay, because we finished activating this product yeah I don't think it's gonna work no Bleh. let's see oh god yeah it's working yeah mm -hmm. initializing some components yeah looking good everything's fine so far mm-hmm yeah it's working really mm. uh, let's see if we fully activate it yes multisim power pro edition really <laughs> yeah let's let's test some components if we chose uh, the power sources I'm not gonna make a, a circuit or something just for the test purpose to prove that it's working in simulation stuff well, put two grounds here. Mm, let's leave one. Mm -hmm. How about we put uh, basic? Yeah, the basics. Where's the resistors? This is resistors. 
Let's stick with one kilo ohm resistor. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Plug everything to complete the circuit to the ground. Mm -hmm. How about we put the uh, what is that thing? Or generator logic multimeter? Yes, and we maybe we're gonna talk about this stuff later on. But yeah, let's test the voltage here. Click run. Yeah, 12 volts. See, everything works just fine. So, uh, thank you so much for watching this videos. In other videos, maybe we'll be getting talking about how to use the word generator, the oscilloscope, and the the logic analyzer stuff. Thank you so much for watching.